At the moment, all what we could do is uh, to run specific script that is located in the scripts section. And we could run this single test script with help of npm test command. We could do this either here in the terminal, or if you want, you could open embedded terminal here in the VS Code. For that, please press key combination, control, back tick like that. And here is embedded terminal. Now here, let's type npm test, like this. And I see following result. Echo, error, no test specified, and exit 1. Error, no test specified. And that's actually result of those two commands. First command is echo, that prints simply some text, error, no test specified. And that's what I see actually here, on this line. And second command is exit 1. It tells to exit this particular script, test script, with code 1. 1 means that specific script was exited with error. If script exits with zero code, it means that there was no error. So, this test script simply prints some text to the terminal, here we see it, and exits with error code 1. You could add many different additional scripts. Now there is just single script called test. Now our project does not contain any other files except package.json, and now it's a very good time to install one of hundreds of thousands of different packages and PM packages available at npmgs.com. Let's go there. Here on the npmgs.com you could search for any package you like. For example, if you search for React, you'll see multiple matches like React, React DOM, ESLint plugin React and so on. Let's search for Express package. Press Enter here. And please click on the first result, Express. And here you'll find page dedicated to Express npm package. Here is weekly downloads count around 16 million times. Here is current version 4.17.1, license, unpacked size, total files, issues, pull requests and so on. All details about this particular npm package. And you could install this particular package, same as other packages at npmgs.com using command npm install. Shortcut is npm i. Let's go ahead and install, for example, this package into our test project. Let's go here and in the embedded terminal, please type npm install and here will be name of the package, express. Let's go ahead and do that, installing. And in a while I see the process was finished and 50 packages were added. 